on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is uh, barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of excitement and expectation. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. They appear to be shaping up in a 4-4-2 formation. I think it gets a, a terrible raw deal these days. It's deemed old-fashioned, outdated, but in truth, with the, the right personnel, it works just as well as, as any other system or formation. Success can still be had with it, and teams are still winning big trophies with exactly this setup. So it's down to business here. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Hoists it forward. And it's played forward. Shapes to shoot! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. Oh, it was such a clever pass that plummets the defence, and it could well be revisited, this. <laughs> Has gone out. Their throw. Still goalless. He's through the middle. Lovely bit of skill. More than the referee's awarded a free kick. In with a header. Oh, just needed a better contact. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. Rushed off the ball there. And let's put a stop to that. Oh, that's nice. There are a few waiting for it. He's had a go! He's hit it first time. Yeah, quick thinking and the right choice for me, but that was difficult to get right.
a chance here. Surely a foul free kick. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Well, that looks like a final warning. Still no card. but not much of one and there's the end of the first half so both sides have drawn blanks and have toiled at times but it's not been a bad game by any means how would you review the first half yeah and despite the scoreline it's clear who the better side is when it comes to chances if this is the trend that's going to continue then there's only going to be one winner here and uh, I don't think it's going to take too much improvement for it to happen. No goals at this stage but certainly not devoid of action. It is nil-nil here at half-time. Here we go again then. A tight old game so far. Can that change now? Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. And no surprise, that's a booking. That should be the keepers. Good spell of possession this, but very little to show for it. Tries to get it forward quickly. Gets the better of his man. Goes for the cross. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. And that's been one straight back. Loose ball, who's going to get there? Can't get the better of his opposite number. Looks to thread it through. Goalkeeper's ball. Still anyone's game, nil-nil. Lovely bit of skill there. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. It's a good finish. The odds were against him. Little matter. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a needle the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of now you've got him, now you don't. Brilliant. If someone tells you to join any social media group for knowing winning stocks, run away. Many people join. Deadlock broken. It's 1-0. The perfect display and the old saying comes to mind when the going gets tough, etc.
गाड़ी से ले रहा है सुन बनाने स्वागत AFC Cup these are these ko preliminary round yo yani round one ra ko sa machinle FC Nepal ra Paro FC Bhutan beat as a group come good to be different different that's a little unfortunate he had a lot of people worrying them afno town banaune cha encounter lai pakka garne cha machinra afno gharilu darshak ma aj darshak stadium ma bhidai cha Paro sang ajo Paro FC चैंपियन टीम रहे भूटान को दर्शिबेन कमेटी बक्स में छू मभिनव जोशी रवाश कि